said it was going to be in more. I could stay in here forever. <laughs> This new mall is like the biggest thing that's happened to me since acrylic nails. I can't wait until it's finished. Me neither. Just looking at it gives me goosebumps. Hey, can't you guys build any faster? Take it easy, Alex. Malls aren't built in a day. Well, until the new one's done, looks like we're stuck with our old tried and true luxury mall. <laughs> Who am I? Mandy! <laughs> yes! Who wants me now? I'm so popular I can't even seek refuge at the mall anymore. <laughs> ah! Trying to be me, as if. It would take you months for the professional makeup artist to achieve my look of perfection. I was totally just playing around, Mandy. Yeah, lighten up a little, beauty queen. Let's blow this makeup stand. No one gets away with calling me beauty queen and not really meaning it. This should bring down that pathetic wannabe. <laughs> hey, you! Stop! Thief! Get back here! <laughs> <laughs> huh? Third floor, gadgets, video, and info on your next assignment. <laughs> this better be urgent, Jer. You interrupted a very important shopping spree. Actually, this mission hits very close to home. It seems something or someone is kidnapping shoppers at exclusive stores called All the Rage, destroying the stores in the process. Destroying stores and abducting people while they shop? How evil and horrible. I know, I know. I'm here for you. Who could be behind this? That's where you come in. You'll be going undercover. As three gorgeous shoppers? Actually, as three TV fashion reporters. Um? Of course, as three gorgeous TV fashion reporters. You'll be going to Cairo, where we're fairly certain this group's next action will be. It's your job to find out where they are and... Yeah, yeah, we know. Come on, girls. We have to save a store. Hang on. Huh? Don't forget your gadgets. Oh, yeah. My favorite part of our missions. Ultra Energy Laser Lip Balm. Jetpack backpacks, hair clip monster grips, fume emitting cameras, voice alterer, compact parasols which double as laser swords, and of course, some cash. Hello, it's the 21st century. We all have credit cards. The CASH, Alex, is a changeable application spy halter top. Could be a parachute, a net, a flotation device. Cool. Uh, yes, only the coolest for you girls. Well, cheerio. Good luck in Cairo. We're here live in ancient but fashionable Egypt. Hey! Point the camera at me, Spielberg. Oopsie. <laughs> See anything strange? Not yet. I'm gonna go look around. Look! There's some sort of laser perimeter on those things! We have to save Sam! There's a skylight! Let's go! warranty on this thing. What's that 
sound. I'm sick of watching this tape. We gotta figure out how to get Sam back. Whoa! Who's that freak? Major freak? Why is he so zoned while everyone with half a brain is in a major panic? Let's see what Jerry thinks of this weirdo. Hello, ladies. Sorry about Sam. I just sent you some pictures from the store. There's a calm, freaky guy in the middle of the crowd. Yes, I see him. Suspiciously calm, eh? Oh, by the way, Clover, the Beverly Hills Mall security office needs to see you ASAP. Some trouble involving shoplifted perfume? Uh, I didn't do it! I'm just the messenger. Ah, yes, here's the scoop. The calm man on the tape is Simon Tucker. He's a former owner of a popular mom-and-pop store in Ireland that was bought out by Harrow's, the high-end store that recently opened a mall near Dublin. Simon Tucker fought to save his store, but couldn't. But why would he be kidnapping people? Sounds like we're going to Ireland to find out. You are spot on correct, my dear. Ta-ta. <sighs> Hi, I'm calling about... Hey, you're the shoplifter. I am so not the shoplifter. I'm totally innocent. That's her, that Clover girl. Uh, what is she doing there? She's a liar. You better turn yourself in, fugitive. Mm. Why is that little witch Mandy there? Ugh, who knows? I'd like to squash her overly perfumed head. Simon Tucker did formerly have a shop on this site. We bought him out and built over him. That's business. He mustn't have been too happy about that. He was paid handsomely. Now, please leave the star. We only cater to a select upscale clientele, and uh, you're not it. Huh? <gasps> you really must leave, or I'll call security. Okay, I'm having enough trouble with mall security. Girlfriend, let's go. We've been kicked out of better stores than this. If this store is built over Simon Tucker's old shop, then maybe we should drop by later to do a little after-hours spying. <laughs> isn't squat about Simon Tucker in any of these files. Huh? Tell me about it. This was just a big waste of time in a gross room. Whoa! Okay, this room is grosser. Hello? These are all Simon Tucker's old files. This must be part of his old store. Listen to this. If they try to steal my store from me, they're going to pay dearly. These capitalist pigs will feel the wrath of anti-consumer teens. Oh! Yeah! rats! I know how to get rid of them. <laughs> what the? Rats! <laughs> chasing us with wooden clubs. Freaky indeed. It appears the club is made from a very rare Sydney red gum tree, which only grows in Sydney, Australia. So, the wackos get their wood from Australia. Okay. Is Simon Tucker from Australia or something? Fair assumption, but we're not definite. What we do know is that his former store was an Australian import shop. <laughs> no wonder his store went under. Speaking